Top story, a woman shot by a San Antonio police officer tonight. And the police chief says the woman pointed a gun towards the officer, and that is why the officer shot her. Ken's 5 reporter Megan Reyna joins us live in the medical center where this all unfold, unfolded just a few hours ago. Megan? EC is Henry. I'm at the intersection of Babcock and Roanoke Run, where right behind me is where the police chief says that woman was waving the gun and then pointed it at the officers. Right now, she's in the hospital, and that last check was in surgery. Just before 6 Thursday night, officers were called out to Babcock Road across from Christus, Santa Rosa, for reports of a woman in her 40s walking up and down the street waving a gun. Officers approached her. She turned, waving the gun. My understanding at this point is that she pointed it. One officer fired one round, hitting her in the abdomen. Police Chief William McManus says the woman was rushed to the hospital and into surgery. The gun seen in the middle of the road as investigators worked the crime scene. McManus says she does have a criminal history. The most recent one is uh, terroristic threats, family violence, and there were some theft charges. But the investigation may hit a roadblock. The chief says earlier in the day, the body camera system the department uses was down. He admits he doesn't know if the cameras were working again when the shooting took place. I haven't seen the body cam, uh, and I'm just taking this from reports that I'm getting from police officers on the scene who are investigating this. This is the second shooting involving police within a week. On Saturday, the chief says his officer shot and killed a man wanted on multiple felony warrants downtown off Broadway. And according to our reporting, Thursday's incident marks the 16th officer-involved shooting with SAPD this year. Now, the chief could not tell me how long of an interaction police had with that woman before they shot her. We do know the officer who fired his weapon has less than a year with SAPD. He's been placed on administrative duty while the investigation unfolds, which is protocol. Reporting live from the medical center, Megan Reyna, Kinspine.